In this video, you've been asked to configure inter-VLAN routing by using a router on a stick. Router 1 needs to be configured to do inter-VLAN routing between VLAN 10 and VLAN 20 and thus will act as a router on a stick in this topology. You'll need to do the full configuration of this lab to get things working. VLAN 1 is going to be configured with subnet 10 1 1 0 slash 24, VLAN 10 with subnet 10 1 10 0 slash 24, that's the VLAN that PC1 belongs to, and VLAN 20 is going to use subnet 10 120 0 slash 24, that's the subnet that PC2 belongs to. You need to configure the router with the last IP address in each subnet, so configure it with the last IP address in VLAN 1, 10, and 20. The switch is going to be configured with IP address 10.1.1.253.24 only. In other words, it's only going to have a management IP address. VLAN 1 is our management VLAN. VLAN 10 and 20 are our user VLANs. We need to configure the VLANs on the switch. So again, PC1 needs to be configured in VLAN 10, PC2 in VLAN 20. We need to configure the link between the switch and the router. So we need to configure this link properly. We need to configure these two links properly. And then we need to make sure that PC1 can ping PC2, PC2 can ping PC1, and can ping the router. For additional credit, configure the network so that the PCs can ping the switch and the switch of the PCs. So can you do it? That's your challenge. Get this network working. Download the packet tracer file and see if you can get it working. In the next video, I'll show you how to configure this network per those instructions.